Hey, what's up guys, I'm Nezio Cole, and recently I have upgraded my Blue Snowball, which is a significantly better microphone and a significantly more expensive microphone. So I figured the only thing right to do would be make a tutorial on how I edit my audio. Now this will be different for everyone's situation. Currently I'm surrounded by sound dampening panels. It just depends on your environment and the room, but if you want a good starting point, I'm just going to be showing you guys how I start off my audio. Now. The first part, if you watch my Blue Snowball tutorial, you'll know is to capture some background audio so that we can do noise reduction. With the Blue Snowball, I did 3 seconds, and with the Blue Yeti, I do 10. So we're just going to go ahead and hit record. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Nizio Cole, and this is a test recording. So we're just going to go ahead and play that back. Uh, not a lot of background noise. Like I said, I'm surrounded by sound dampening panels, but my computer is also right next to me, so it's probably what it's cutting out. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Nizio Cole, and this is a test recording. It, it would be good for your average YouTube video. It would be good for that, but that's not what I do. So the first thing I do is select the first 10 seconds and then go to Effect, Noise Reduction, Get Noise Profile. So that just basically gets the profile of the noise, your background noise, your computer, your fan, whatever it may be. Although if you are recording with the fan on, I recommend turning it. And then I'm just going to double click to select the entire recording and then effect noise reduction. Okay. You may think nothing happened, but that's because it's a 14 second recording. Now with longer recordings like 20, 30, 40, even an hour, uh, I'd say the most I've had it take was five minutes to complete the noise reduction process. But let's just go ahead and listen to that again. Hey, what's up guys, I'm Nizio Cole, and this is a test recording. So you can see it sounds a lot more isolated, and that's pretty much all it does. Uh, I have minimal background noise, obviously, but this does really help if you have a window open, or you have a fan, or your air conditioning. It just, there's so many variables that, that noise reduction is such an important step of the audio editing process. Now the next step I do is normalization, and I will show you guys all of my settings. Uh, so you want to go over to effect and then normalize. I have removed DC offset checked and normalization maximum altitude to negative one decibels and that is also checked. If you want to copy down my settings real quick, then press OK. Now we're just going to give it a listen. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Nizio Cole and this is a test recording. So as you can hear, it brought up the audio a little bit. Next step is compression. So you want to go over to effect, compressor. You want to copy down my settings negative 20, negative 40, 2 to 1, 0.5, and then 1 second. And then these bottom two are also not checked. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Nizio Cole, and this is a test recording. This actually probably seemed counterintuitive because normalization made it louder and compression made it quieter, but trust me, when you're editing this audio, it does really, really help, especially with mixing the game audio and the background music and your voice it you know it tends to get complicated but doing those two steps just kind of makes your whole life a little easier and the last thing i do is effect bass and treble you can copy down my settings one zero negative one point one and check enable level control and do okay that just adds a little bit more hey what's up guys i'm nizio cole and this is a test recording so that just adds a little bit more fullness to your voice, and that's pretty much all I can say about that. Uh, you can play around with these settings as much as you like. That's just what I use. You can tell it's a lot more simpler than my Blue Snowball method, which I uploaded actually over a year ago, if you guys want to go check that out. But yeah, that's pretty much all I had to talk about. By the way, the audio on this episode will not be edited because I cannot have two Audacity recordings open at the same time for some reason. And yeah, that's pretty much all I had to talk about. See you guys later. Peace.